what is it like for you now as being a black man in America? Yeah. What is it? What's the take now? Um, there's obviously a lot of changes going along. Right. You know, Obama's about to leave. But on right. a political landscape, how do you feel the black experience may be changing or where do you think it's headed? I mean, I, you know, I, it's, it's hard to speak uh, as if we are a, a monolithic people. You know, I don't think that we're only judged by one experience. Um, what I will say is that, you know, the, the, the black man in America since the beginning has always been a target. You know, and, you know, it's, it's, it's nothing new. You know, I think that we've seen this. Uh, what's new is that we have phones <laughs> and we can capture it, you know, for the world to see. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I think that walking around and it doesn't even, and that's the thing, too, man. It's like, you know, it's so easy to get into, like, the politics of being African, the politics of being immigrant, the politics of being Caribbean, the politics of being black American. You can get into all that if you want to. But at the end of the day. When you're looking through, you know, the, 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 the crosshairs, <laughs> we all look the same. We all look the same. And there is no differentiation when you're looking through the crosshairs. We're all a target, you know. Um, but I also say that, you know, I don't live my life as a, as a victim. I don't live my life out of fear. You know what I mean? I'm very, very clear on who I am and what I'm here for. And I know that my time is limited. So when my time comes, my time will come. So I don't walk around in fear, I walk around in power. I walk around knowing my purposes, you know what I mean? I don't walk around knowing what God gave me. So I just make sure that, you know, and me being in tune with that, I just allow my light to shine. And I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't so I don't walk around, you know, thinking about, uh, yeah, my days being numbered or being a target or, or any of these things, man. It's like, for me, I focus on, am I gonna be able to put all of my time and my energy into accomplishing the mission that God sent me on earth for? And I'll just, as long as I do that every day, I'm good. I'm good, you know? And, and what will come out of that is, uh, like I said, man, it's like when you're in tune with what you're here for, you know, God will give you the opportunity and open the doors for you to be able to create something that'll last longer than you. And that's all I'm here for. That's all my focus is on.